Hello, friends and family. Five dimensions of pride or five forms of pride. Number one, pride of face. Number two, pride of place. Number three, pride of race. Number four, pride of peace. And number five, pride of grace. Let's break it down. Number one, pride of face. This is the pride that comes as a result of your physical looks. Oh, I'm beautiful, I'm handsome, I look good, I'm attractive, and you begin to get proud. Forgetting that you are not your creator, you are not your designer. It's God that made you beautiful, it's God that made you handsome. So what is the place for pride in your looks? Number two, pride of place. That is a pride of position. Oh, I am the managing director of so-and-so -so company. I am the PA to the president. I am the chief executive officer of so-and-so, so-and-so, so and so, -so, so, -and -so, -and -so. Forgetting that no man can receive anything except it is given to him from heaven. So any position that a man occupies was made possible by divine enablement. So what is the place for pride? So no matter the place you occupy in life, there is no reason for pride because God put you there. And the God who put you there can remove you. Hello? Pride of race. The, the, the family background you come from, the ethnic group you come from, this, I belong to this family, we are so, so, and so, rich family, wealthy, you know, well to do. What is the place of pride? It's God that put you there. You are just privileged. It's not because of anything. So there is no place for pride. Now, for, for pride of peace, how far you have gone in life? I have hustled, I've done the best, I have three PhDs, I have this and that, I have labored to build this company, I have labored to build this church, ministry. Forgetting that it is God who has given you the ability to achieve that much. Because no man can receive anything except it is given from heaven. And number five, pride of grace. You are proud of the power that God has given you. You are proud of the anointing. Forgetting that the God who gave you can remove it. May God help us to do better in the mighty name of Jesus. So I'll see you again. I am Apostle Oluwa Tudia I say God bless you. Have a lovely day.